I'm going to demonstrate how I upgrade or update the Ziyun Smooth 4 firmware. Now here's the thing, the latest firmware has already been around since 2018. I haven't updated the firmware yet because I've read problems from other people's reviews. After they have updated to the latest firmware, they encountered problems. So I don't suggest you update or upgrade your firmware after watching this video. It's your choice. Let's do it! First of all, let's not confuse the firmware version with the app version. The firmware is a software that installs inside the electronics of the Ziyun Smooth 4. The ZY Play app that controls the Ziyun Smooth 4 has got its own version and lives on your phone. How do you check your Ziyun Smooth 4 version? First, ensure your Ziyun Smooth 4 is turned on and then go to the ZY Play app and connect. Press the menu button on the Ziyun Smooth 4, scroll to settings and press select. Inside the settings menu, select general and there you go. Look at the OTA version 1.76. That's the firmware version of my Ziyun Smooth 4. Which is the latest firmware right now? According to the official website, the latest firmware is version 1.77. What's new in version 1.77? According to various sources, version 1.77 fixes zoom and focus failure. I also have the list of other versions and the problems they fixed. Feel free to download the list from my website. Go to this link here. I never had any problem with zoom and focus on my version 1.76. So the question now is, should I update? Here's my analysis after reading lots of problems from other people that have already updated. So here goes. If you own an Android phone and gonna use the Android phone with the Ziyun Smooth 4, don't update. You might face more problems. So, how do you update the Ziyun Smooth 4 firmware? You may like to download the step-by-step -step diagram. Just go to this link now. First, you will need a USB to USB-C cable. Second, you will need a computer. In this case, I'll be using my MacBook Pro. Third is of course your Ziyun Smooth 4. Fourth is to click the thumbs up. And fifth is to hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so. Just kidding. I mean, I'm serious. Step 1. On your computer internet browser, go to ziyun-tech.com and slash en for the English version. Step 2. In the ziyun official website, look for the tab called Download and click on Firmware. Scroll down the page to look for Smooth 4. There you go. Click on the Smooth 4 image. This will take us to the Smooth 4 sales page. Scroll down the page till you see a download tab. Click on the download tab. What we want to download are two software, the calibration upgrade tool and the firmware. Since I'm using a MacBook Pro, I'm going to download the Mac OS version. Click on download. Next, I'll download the firmware by clicking on the download button. When I open up my downloads folder, I can see my calibration tool zip file and the firmware zip file. Just in case you are curious, the calibration or upgrade tool is about 15 megabytes, while the firmware is about 179 kilobytes. Now let's unzip the upgrade tool by clicking on the zip file. Now let's unzip the firmware zip file. 
The Zhiyun Gimbal tools become an app after unzipping. The Smooth 4 firmware zip file becomes a folder after unzipping. Inside the folder, we have a change log file and a firmware.ptz file. Ensure that the Smooth 4 is turned off. Connect the USB-C end of the USB cable into the USB-C port of the Smooth 4. Connect the other end of the USB cable into the computer's USB port. Ensure that your computer is fully charged or powered up at all times. I'm now going to power up the Smooth 4 by pressing the power button for about 3 seconds. I will now go back to the computer's download folder and right click on the Zhiyun Gimbal's Tools app and select Open. Are you sure you want to open it? Of course, click on Open. So this is the Zhiyun Gimbal Tools app. On the top left corner, I have to select the USB port that I've used to connect with the Smooth 4. When I click on the selection, I only have one detected. So all I have to do is to click on Open. And at the bottom of the toolbox, I will see a message saying Serial port is already open. Next, I'll ensure that the Firmware Upgrade tab is selected. Now, I'm going to specify the path to the firmware which we have downloaded by clicking on Browse. So my firmware is inside my Downloads folder under the Smooth 4 Firmware folder and click on it. Select firmware.ptz and click on Open. I see a bunch of file info, device numbers, hardware numbers and firmware numbers. Now go to the bottom of the tool and click on the Upgrade button. I see a red light blinking over here. Okay, the lights are off. And it's back on. It's back to normal. On the Tools app, I noticed it says Serial Port has been closed. That means it's done. That took like less than 30 seconds. Okay, the blue light here is blinking because it's connected to the USB and therefore the battery is charging inside this mode 4. After the upgrade, the Smooth 4 is automatically turned off. So let me turn it back on again. Connect the ZY Play app. Go into the settings. Go into general tab. And there you go. The OTA version is now 1.77. Success! <laughs> so, indeed it's true. The upgrade of the firmware to 1.77 on the Zhiyun Smooth 4 works for the iPhone but not for Android phones, especially my Samsung Galaxy S10. Connect it via Bluetooth. So it's scanning, it's searching. Let's see whether it finds the Zhiyun Smooth 4. Oops, device not detected. Device not detected. Mm.